Good morning, everyone. We are Thursday morning at Long Beach. I don't have my motor room, so I'm in uh, my hotel room and uh, gonna get to uh, do some DHL visit this morning. Uh, one for uh, the retailer, another one with some people that are coming to a shop and then uh, back to the truck, truck walk. Uh, what's the weather doing like? Um, yeah, it's a decent view. Uh, race truck just around there. Oh, actually the race truck is here on the right hand side where the cones are. Uh, it's a bit gray, it's a bit fresh in California, but um, that's gonna be, it's gonna be a good day. Here we are, just finished DHL event. Uh, it's raining in California and actually raining a lot and it's very cold. Uh, quite funny, heading back to Long Beach now, but uh, that was uh, fun to meet <laughs> to meet uh, a lot of uh, a lot of fans that came out. Here we go, getting to the uh, getting to the paddock. Uh, we're downtown. Car park behind me. Truck in front of me. Uh, I'm gonna sneak to the paddock, engine meeting, and then uh, truck walk. I'm gonna take you through the lap. I'll show you some of the the cool stuff around Long Beach. I guess I did pretty well last year, so I know some cool stuff and uh, I'll try to explain to you what, uh, what we look for and what the difference is and um, what's good in Long Beach. Yeah, that's Stand three Fontaine. It's pretty, uh, pretty tight, they change a bit inside. But yeah, you really want to put your, your wheel there on the apex, that's where the grip is and it's uh, pretty, uh, pretty tight on the exit as well. It's gonna be five and six, I believe. Five here, second gear corner, pretty fast. Opens a bit on exit. And then I'll show you the next one, which is a tricky one. Here we go, next right corner. Questions always being, do we use the inside curb or not? Now you can actually see there's a lot of banking, negative banking and exit, so the car wants to slide. But there's your apex, there's your exit. Very wide exit, but very off camber. It's turn eight. Turn eight. Uh, six. six? No, that's eight. Eight down there. No, six and eight. Nine, Nine. over there, ten, eleven. Well, this is the corner. Uh, and they changed a bit the wall. Uh, I mean, we can't really see the exit. The wall's been moved a bit far on the outside. There's a new. There's a lot of cars as well. But there's a new thing on the outside. Hello, Al. That's a photographer. Uh, new tarmac right here, so we go from one on entry to concrete to tarmac. That section of the lap, if you know Long Beach, you know that part. It's very grippy here, it's very slippery down there where the drift cars are going, so we absolutely don't want to go too wide on that exit. And then the next corner is actually pretty fun and, uh, and difficult to find the right balance. Long Beach Irpin, come here, get the apex right here. And off you go for a very, very long straight line. So here we are, end of day one. It's been a long day, quite a lot of uh, appearances for DHL. I'm gonna be honest, the three hours time difference with Miami, a bit painful. Uh, going now to uh, media dinner with the team. Actually walking over the paddock. Uh, that's the yeah, pit lane right here. Straight line down there. Uh, yeah, and tomorrow, finally get to drive. Oh, look at that boys, we've got the Queen Murray here. Uh, it's kind of a coincidence that they end up being here. So we wait for Carl, it's day two, and we're gonna do some social content. That guy's normally always behind the camera, I know he's in front of it. I don't know what to do. Uh, that guy too, he asks all the questions. Sorry. Sorry. And uh, Carl is late, so I don't know what we're gonna do today. Yeah. Hopefully not baseball naming. Because I run out of inspiration. Right. Right. Me like that. <laughs> there you go, guys. Look at that. Well, that's where my helmet is. Oh, I need to tell you about this. All right. That's a great ball, and that's for our first win. It's here, and it's ready for first win. And look at that. That's my favorite cupboard. All my favorite snacks. Can you tell the GoPro what the big game is? I can't even tell that at all. Little red lights on. Oh, red. See, it's on top. You're gonna be famous. Now. Yeah, it's on. Yeah. yeah. This is famous. You think we're gonna be famous? This is gonna be big. Oh! Oh, fucking hell! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that's what. That's why I told him to victory lane. If I win, you can do anything you want. <laughs> Could I ask you for the wheel, please? For the what? The wheel. Oh yeah. 
Yeah, but uh, that one could be a bit tighter. That one is a bit longer. I okay. Think. Yeah. We'll tighten up that one. Yeah, that's the other way. side. Is it okay? Oh, what, it, what is that? Oh, happy. Oh, it looks good. So just ahead of uh, through practice session one, we are in the, look at my changing room. We've got a spare helmet, got a race suit, underwear, a couple more things in here. Um, we've got Josh, the guy that talks me on the radio, sits here. An engineer here. And uh, just, yeah, it's so far to relax. So that's why I stay proud to race. Hi. Say hi to my YouTube, hey! Oh. So here we are, days is over and we have a long line of photograph stations coming and I hope my teammates are not too late. That's Kyle coming, good. And uh, yeah, that's a social guy. That's for YouTube, brother. Morning everyone, Saturday, 7 a.m. It's an early start here. We got uh, practice 8, 45, 9, 45, qualifying 12 to 1, 20 p.m. Uh, practice is not going to be super representative of qualifying because it's freezing cold this morning. But we try to give you the best we can and uh, get a good rain on the car and get ready for quality. Morning everyone, it's race day, 7.50am, it's early, it's a bit fresh right now, a bit of a cast as well, I've got warm at 9am, race at 12.45 I believe, uh, I'm gonna check a warm up, everything is good, but we should have a good cast, so just check the conditions are a bit different, IMSA race yesterday for two hours, so a bit more rubber on track, but uh, should be good. The Acura Grand Prix of Long Beach is away and we're going to get some great stars. Kirkwood, no stranger to leading the junior formulas, but this is his first time in the big leagues as Erickson goes to the outside. Pato Award trying to make it three wide. It's going to be Kyle Kirkwood leading, but side by side, Grosjean and Joseph Newgard heading into the foul. This is one lane only, Townsend. Trying to catch up to the back of the field. Like I was saying earlier, Long Beach is so unique in that it's the only track we go to where you can't run side by side to the last corner. side as we see one of the McLarens, Pato Award going inside of Grosjean. Oh, it's on, Slow. look at this. Down to turn eight, here comes Award oh. again. Pato Award spins, Ericsson hits him, Kirkwood gets away with it. the call from the team and Grosjean's in the pits Dave his teammate Grosjean gives up a second place he'll get fresh unused Firestone primary tires on there no changes elsewise to the 28 car out goes that DHL Honda Alexander Ross a young American behind the wheel Kyle Kirkwood is your latest IndyCar race winner amazing job amazing job he has the car today but it's good to kind of awesome man went to a great deal awesome guys made it back to Indy, uh, P2 in Long Beach, pretty exciting, um, just uh, didn't have enough fuel to uh, use my push to pass and try to get Kyle Kirkwood, but all in all a very good weekend, uh, a lot of fans, um, good cars, one, two, four at the finish line for Andretti, I've got Simulator tomorrow and then we've got Indy 500 open test further Friday and then I'll be going home on Saturday, uh, eating my birthday cake with my kids. <laughs>